dreamed a dream in time gone by. Watch Susan Boyle and I thought her performance was great, you know. I, I, I've said earlier, I've said another time, you know, it's always great when when the voice doesn't match the, the appearance, if you like, you know, because people just get a shock and it was a similar case with Paul Potts, so, no, it was great and as soon as I heard, you know, there was a lady for Blackburn going to be there and I tuned in and all you know, the best there. Yeah. And, you know, if she doesn't win, you know, there's already been a lot of hype surrounding her anyway, you know, people from America are interested in her, so, you know, winning is not the main thing, you know, in the grand scheme of things, but, you know, she's just got to... Uh, give it her all in each performance that she's going to do in the remainder of the show and just uh, live, I live for the music really, you know, so as long as you keep passionate, you know, you should go a long way. I mean, the X Factor for me is an amazing stepping stone, you know, I learned so much within that time, you know, the last two years have been an absolute learning curve. The record company, you know, renewing my contract was obviously, you know, a bit of a blow at the, at the start, but I'm happy, you know, I'm, I've I'm the happiest I've probably been since starting out in music. I've been learning to play guitar for about five, five and a half months now, and it's, you know, I've picked it up really quite quickly, which has been fantastic, because it's helped me with my songwriting and stuff. You know, I've already written some small pieces of music, which I'm hoping to use. I'm always grateful today, um, Scottish gigs, you know, it's, people can relate to you probably a wee bit more because, you know, you come from the same place type thing. Um, you know, I, I just like playing live music to everybody, that's what it's all about for me, so, you know, any gig I'm in. But playing Glasgow, Clyde Auditorium, again, this is our second date, we sold it the first on the 15th of May, and we're going to be performing again on the 23rd, which is fantastic. The Glasgow one's really special for me because it's a lovely venue, you know, um, it's right next door to where I auditioned for the X Factor in the first place, so it kind of start, started there, you know, and came full circle, if you like.